Now to the anger over that young girl patted down while going through security at a North Carolina airport. Her outraged father recording the entire incident on his cell phone. And ABC's Kena Whitworth is here with that story for us. Good morning, Kena. Robin, good morning to you. So her dad calling it invasive and inappropriate. And this morning, he plans on filing a complaint against the TSA after he says he was left fuming when his 10-year-old daughter was subjected to a pat-down. A pouch of juice inside this purse, leading to what one father believes was an excessive pat down on his young daughter. She's going to be receiving a pat down, which means I will start at her head, work my way down to her feet, patting her down. A female TSA agent at the Raleigh Durham International Airport in North Carolina subjecting 10 year old Vendela Brainerd Payne to the two minute procedure, leaving the girl feeling uncomfortable and her father outraged. I felt it was incredibly inappropriate, very invasive, and it really violated my daughter. Kevin Payne capturing the incident and his daughter's discomfort on his cell phone. She just kept doing it over and over. I felt very uncomfortable. I felt like screaming. Payne says he plans on filing a complaint with the help of Congressman Scott Peters. A spokesperson for the TSA telling Good Morning America that screening procedures allow for the pat down of a child under certain circumstances. The process by which the child was patted down followed approved procedures. The TSA also stating that the child's bag contained a cell phone that alarmed, requiring additional resolution procedures. So the TSA has modified their screening policies in the last few years to reduce the likelihood of a pat down for children. So kids under 12 can leave on their shoes and a light jacket. And like you saw in that video, they won't be separated from their parents. But clearly, that's not enough for Payne, who also pointed out that his daughter's pat down lasted nearly two minutes. The TSA is in a tough position. You yeah. know, they're, they're, they're there to protect us. And something like this happens. A father was able to watch. You have you have young daughters. I mean, how, how would you feel if you, if well, you saw that? You know what? I I think I would be okay with it because mm -hmm. I'd rather it could be err on the side of caution mm -hmm. instead of, you know, people can use a child to get things through the TSA. So I think that's where the, 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 the hard part for the TSA comes in. Right, and that is the line. exactly, that's the point of the TSA. They don't want to let anything get through. And the point of the parent being that he wants to protect sure, his children, yeah. but he handled it well. And in the mm -hmm. end, in the video, you hear him thanking the TSA for doing their job. And all this time, I thought the hardest part about those Capri Suns was getting the straw <laughs> in, you know? <laughs> 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 Thank you so much. Like that, but it's been very lively the discussion on social yes, media yes. about this. Good to have you here on, oh, on the West Coast, Kana. Thank, thank, thank you. Thank you so much.